There's another food drivers have had their eye on this weekend. A long-standing Martinsville culinary tradition returns this weekend with the races. Yeah, we're talking about the world-famous Southern-style hot dogs mm. they serve there. Man, are they good. <laughs> and drivers say that they look forward to them uh, year after year. Our 10 Sports, uh, Brooke Leonard, is in Martinsville tonight as well. And, Brooke, uh, the drivers have been eager to chow down on those dogs. Yeah, guys, and I actually have one right here. We're going to save it for after we hear from these drivers just how good these hot dogs are. But ultimately, Martinsville is all about tradition. Where the finish line meets the Martinsville Speedway inscription sits the hot dog stand, a staple at the paperclip. These aren't just your ordinary ballpark hot dogs. In fact, you can't even call them that. The Jesse Jones Southern Style Red Dog is the official title, and the prices haven't changed much since 1947. The Red Dog, chili, slaw, mustard, and onions, only $2. And like many traditions in NASCAR, this one makes drivers look forward to racing at Martinsville. I, I like them. Uh, I, you know, it's been a minute since I've had them. But when we went there in the, in the truck series back a while ago when I was racing that, um, we always had an open tab. So you could just walk up and tell them that you were truck number or whatever, and you get all the hot dogs you wanted. So I ate a lot of hot dogs when I was there in the truck series through the weekend. Microphone out so I can say that I hate onions. All right, Shane, moment of truth. This is your first hot dog from Martinsville. Here you go. I got I got I got to get I don't like onions and I don't like slaw. But you'll so. love the hot dog. Mm. Now we know why the drivers like it. All right, Xfinity kicking off here at 8 o'clock tonight. We'll have more on sports, previewing what to expect from the cup race tomorrow night.